The International Monetary Fund, IMF, said on Friday that the Nigerian economy was still vulnerable despite the country exiting recession. The IMF in a statement issued by its media and press officer, Rafael Raspach, welcomed the federal government's actions to improve the power sector and business environment under the Economic Recovery and Growth Plan, EGRP. The fund said the macroeconomic and structural reforms remained urgent to contain vulnerability and support sustainable private sector-led growth. The IMF said its staff team led by the senior resident representative and mission chief for Egeria, Amin Mati, visited the country from December 6 to 20 to conduct the 2018 Article 4 consultation, which led to this report the statement said, overall growth is slowly picking up but recovery remains challenging. Economic activity expanded by 1.4% year-on-year in the third quarter of 2017 the second consecutive quarter of positive growth after five quarters of recession driven by recovering oil production and agriculture however, growth in the non-oil non-agricultural sector, representing about 65% of the economy, contracted in the first three quarters of 2017 relative to the same period last year difficulties in accessing financing and high inflation continued to weigh on. Companies' performance and consumer demand headline inflation declined to 15.9% by end November, from 18.5% at end of 2016, but remains sticky despite tight liquidity conditions high fiscal deficits driven by weak revenue mobilization generated large financing needs, which, when combined with tight monetary policy necessary to reduce inflationary pressures, increased pressure on bond yields and crowded out private sector credit.